Welcome, my name is Anthony and I'm the founder and CEO of linuxacademy.com. Today I'm excited to show you one of our new beta features for our enterprise feature set at Linux Academy. Now, what I would like to show you here is I'm logged in to linuxacademy.com and I'm gonna go ahead and select manage team. Now here, what we're gonna be focusing on today is we're gonna be focusing on training pipelines. Training pipeline solves a particularly large problem of managing specific training sets for large amounts of employees within your environment. So I'm gonna go ahead and select training pipelines. Training pipelines allows me to assign specific courses, quizzes, or assessments to individual employees, team members, or entire teams themselves. I can also create a team or just a team member for a pre-hire assessment. If I'd like this potential employee to take a Linux Academy quiz, practice exam, or one of our performance-based assessments. So all I need to do is select create one to create my first pipeline. I'm gonna call this pipeline enterprise training. And our short description is gonna be required training for all company employees. So for example, you can use this to say all employees need to at least take this minimum training. Then other team managers can assign their own training and you can create additional pipelines. I can actually assign multiple pipelines to multiple team members or students at one time. And I can select next. Now that this is created, I'm gonna go ahead and add a course. We always want our students to start with the introduction to Linux Academy course in order to learn how to connect to our labs and how our platform works. So we'll select Introduction to Linux Academy. I can review the course if I want or just add it to my pipeline. And we can see here that our pipeline is now being generated. If I wanna delete it, I can mouse over and select Delete. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and add a course. Perhaps we want our students to dive right into Linux Essentials. And then we'll go ahead and select Add. After Linux Essentials, we want to grade the work see if they have the required knowledge to move forward. So I can add an assessment. An assessment here, for example, we can select the Linux Fundamentals Assessment, and we can add this to their pipeline. After this, perhaps we want them to get familiar with cloud computing. Again, we can add a course, we can go to AWS, and perhaps we want to assign this AWS Certified Solutions Architect Associate Level, and we'll select Add. So here's our pipeline. I can reorder my pipeline if I want, and I can delete items from my pipeline. After this, when I'm done creating my pipeline, I can go ahead and save it. And we now have our created pipeline. At this point, I don't have any teams or team members that are assigned to this pipeline. So I can go ahead and click assign members. I can search for individual members or I can select them and assign them myself. Or I can assign entire teams. So for example, if I wanna assign everybody in a pre-hire assessment, so if I select pre-hire assessments, everybody that's in my pre-hire assessment team will be assigned this training pipeline. After we make changes to our training pipeline, it takes us back to our overview. And if we browse down, we see all members that are assigned to this individual pipeline. I can remove them or I can assign more again by either going to assign individual members, which lists everybody inside of my organization through all teams or individual teams. Now, as that individual here, if we logged in, how does our student see this training pipeline assigned to it? So let me go ahead and open up this individual account. Now I've logged in as an individual user, and we see here that I've been assigned to the enterprise training training pipeline. And what I need to do next is I need to go through the introduction to the Linux Academy. Now at this time, what it's showing me is what I need to complete next. This is the training I need to complete. I need to complete this course. I need to complete this pre-hire assessment. Now, one of our features that will be released here in a few weeks is the ability to track progress. So this student will be able to view their progress on the training pipeline and a manager or organization lead can also view their progress in the training pipeline. So that concludes it for our introduction to training pipelines. This is a beta product. We are releasing new features on it every single day. We greatly appreciate you being a Linux Academy member. And if you have questions, please feel free to contact us at any time.